The sign outside the Rapid Refill store says absolutely no bike riding, skateboarding, or loitering. Well, I should probably add sleeping to that list of things you can't do here. She was laying like right here. I mean, her feet were like right here and just laying right here like this. <laughs> just laying on the floor right here. Store manager Brent Henley found the burglar sound asleep by the front door. I thought that they were intoxicated because when I, I did say, you know, hey, you know, hello, they were, you know, slurred words where I really couldn't understand what they were saying. He grabbed the phone and called 911 and the suspect stumbled to the bathroom in the back of the store where she stayed until Spokane Valley police arrived and arrested her. It appears the burglar got in through an unlocked back door, ate some cookies in the back, and then packed up some loot. What did she try to take her? Uh, just uh, property within uh, the business, like the printer and some ink cartridges, that type of uh, office supply stuff. But this cat burglar took a cat nap before she staged her getaway. Henley says police said the suspect's cell phone apparently contained text messages discussing the break-in. From what the officers were saying, it looked like maybe this was something that could have been planned. Or It was certainly nothing Henley planned on finding on a Monday morning. That was the most interesting thing I've ever seen <laughs> coming in from a vacation. The suspect was already wanted on warrants for larceny and theft and now faces burglary charges. We'll be catching up on her sleep in the Spokane County Jail. In Spokane Valley, Eric Loney, KXY4 HD News.